How are you? It's my first video in English and first, sorry if I say something wrong, okay? Uh, well, it's my video to explain here uh, the cockpit CMS with search we're using Detectivo plus TNT search. Why? Because I write on my medium about it and you can see, I will put the link on the description. Uh, it just explained because I looking a lot on the internet about it and no one explaining about it. Explain it. Okay, uh, let's start because it's a short video. Okay, here we have our the cockpit folders, right? When you install the, the Detectivo, um, you have these folders. And next, we need to download the Detectivo and apply this on the add-ons folder. And here is our Detectivo, right? And how it works. Okay, we just will look in here in TNT search just to explain. Okay, when this starts, it will create a folder called TNT index on your storage. Okay, here, MKG, TNT index. And they will create a little database called TNT index using SQLite and the memory. Um, if you're using MongoDB with Cockpit, that's okay because your storage, your database is MongoDB and your search we use um, SQLite. It works completely work, okay? Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay. Uh -huh. Let's the for the next folder it's config uh, in the config we we'll put this step by step detectivo he called the detectivo here and using the engine uh, TNT search and the collections you need search you need find found uh, here for me I put the post because it's a blog like title subtitle and content I just can found my posts using title or subtitle or content okay and it's simple it's just it uh, okay when we make another entry here to create our blog page maybe uh, blog content uh, blog content title and blog subtitle. Uh, don't have slug again. Blog test. Okay. Uh, I will save it. Okay. And in articles again, I have it here my blog content, right? And okay, now how it work on the code. Well, the Detectivo with TNT search will create this folder called TNT index inside the storage. Uh, here have my post.index. Why? Every time when I create a new post, he will update this archive to save my title, subtitle, content, maybe. Um, but he will save my ID. Okay. Why? Because in my database have my full content and in this search in this storage have just my id and these words to found this okay let's here i have here i'm show to you two ids these ids is from uh my test test content but i create another one right he call it blog content and I will blog here and okay I have my ID for my blog content and well how it's work it's a API you can put in whatever uh, postman uh, insomnia or you can create in your front-end JavaScript to find this and well when the user will look for something on your website using the search um, maybe we'll show to the user a drop down and when the user click you keep this ID and 
show the user the full content when he click on it okay well um, for this video is just it it have a full uh, information here on my medium well um, thanks to me bye bye